Hello everybody, my name is Ezekiel Lincoln. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm glad that you're watching this video today because today I want to talk about prayer. I want to talk about prayer, how, how important it is to pray and to seek the Lord and to call upon the name of God each and every day. So if you like this subject, please subscribe to my channel, like, share this video. All right, let's get right into it. Well, first of all, I want to talk about a story today, something that I encountered today. See, I was on my way to work, and you know, I live in Belgium, and uh, right now we're having a COVID lockdown. I mean, not a lockdown, but we have some COVID measures. Like everybody is compulsory to wear a, mask, a face mask in the train. So uh, I got on the train and uh, there was an old man that didn't have a mask and he had a tissue right before his nose. And uh, so I, I paused a little bit. I said, wait a minute, don't I have a spare mask in my jacket? So I gave him the, the mask and he was like, should I pay you back? Should I give you money for the mask? I said, no. I told him, no. No need to give me anything for the mask. It's for free. And then he went and sat down. And after a few minutes, he came back to me. He said, sir, I, I want to I I reimburse you for the mask. I want to give you money for the mask. So he, he gave me $2, I mean, 2 euros for the mask. I was like, no, don't give me no money. Don't, I, I, don't want, I don't want no money. But he insisted, so he gave me the two euros. What can I do with two euros? So I just put it in my pocket and uh, I told him, sir, have a nice day and enjoy your day. And uh, But that just to tell you, it's like selflessness is, wish, is what every Christian should be like, to be selfless. To be to give to have a giving spirit to have a, a giving a, a, a giving spirit and um, that's 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 the thing. But today I really want to talk about prayer because I was watching a, a video on YouTube and uh, I would I don't want to call the channel name, but uh, some uh, a Christian couple uh, who. I believe that the faith is very strong, and um, we're talking about prayer. How prayer is very, very important. How prayer shouldn't be like, oh God, Lord, I need this, or Lord, help me, but I need this, please, please bless me. No, but prayer should be something that we should cry out to the Lord. We should literally cry out to the Lord, like we are in a, like we are in a coffin being buried alive. We should scream out, cry out, scream out to the Lord. Scream out to the Lord and cry out to the Lord. And say, Lord, I need you. I need you to come to my rescue. I need you to save me. I need you to deliver me. I need you to heal me. And that's what prayer should be all about. God said we have to be bold when we come to, before his throne of grace. We should cry out to him. We should cry out to him and, 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 and seek his face on a daily basis. Seek his face. And I believe, like I said in my previous video, even though God has left the heavens, all the heavens, by the way, that he's not here, but I believe that there are forces that do answer prayers. Yes, I said it. There are forces that do answer prayer. You might call them the Illuminati or angels or whatsoever, but they do answer prayers. But I, I believe that God is now on earth and that Jesus and all his angels have left the world. And um, there's uh, somebody who's, who's here, who's running all this thing. Somebody who's here running this world which ruling this world. But as for us Christians, we should always pray. Men should not think, but always pray, always pray. Even, even wake up in the morning before sunrise, before the sunrise is a key. You remember that scripture when Jacob uh, wrestled with the angel of the Lord 
or with with the angel of the Lord and right before sunrise the angel said you gotta let me go you gotta let me go I have to go and Jacob said I wouldn't let you go unless you bless me bless me then I will let you go and that's the attitude we should have that's the spirit that we should have we should cry out to God we should wrestle with God in prayer we should wrestle with God in prayer, cry out to God in prayer, and ask him, Lord, Lord, bless me before you go. Bless me before this battle ends. Because we are in a war, saints. We are in a war. We are in a we are definitely in a war. And this war is rage. Oh, oh my God, you wouldn't believe it. This war is still going on. We have actually been attacked on, on our, uh, on our souls. The battle is still raging. Our enemies of our soul cease to devour us. Like I said in my previous video, they seek the enemies of our soul cease to devour us. They seek to destroy our souls. And we should cry out to the Lord each and every day. It's like, don't be content with what you where you at right now. Don't be content. Don't be like, oh, I, I'm blessed. I have this car. I have a I have a huge house. I have a beautiful wife and this and that. No, don't be content with what you have. Always call upon the Lord, even if things are going good with you. Especially when things are going good with you, call upon the name of the Lord and pray. And pray. That's my first point. And my second point, give. Be sharing. Be, be selfless. Be selfless in all that you do. If you're going to work, work hard. If you have a job, work and be and work hard. Give you 110%. Don't just be on time. Because you have to be on time and you leave when it when the bell rings and you go home. But put in the hours, work. Be selfless and use that money that you have, that you have earned, and share it with your brother who is in need. Share it with your brothers who are in need. Especially those you know, those people in Africa, our our brethren in Africa. Our brethren, not even we don't have to look that far. You can, you can turn to those people who are sleeping on the streets, the homeless. Bless them. Be a blessing towards others. Be a blessing towards others, folks. Saints all over the world, I just want to encourage you to, to be a blessing towards everyone that comes on your path. Because God, God is watching. God is not here, but he's going to return. Amen. Jesus Christ is returning with all his saints and all his holy ones. And he's going to rage war against the son of lawlessness. So for that day to come, we have to be prepared. We have to, we have to be prepared and ready for that day. Don't let Jesus find you naked, my brethren. Don't let Jesus catch you naked or asleep. Don't sleep. But be aware, be, be, be ready for the Lord. And always pray. Always pray. Always thank God for all his goodness. And seek the Lord for all your needs. And give to the poor. Be selfless. Share what you have. That's my mission. That's, that's my mission that I want to have personally. Is everything that I, that I do, I want to say 40% of my income. And with that, with that other, with that 40%, I want to give to the poor. Where I see somebody on the street talking about, oh, help me, sir. I don't have nothing to eat. I'm like, here, sir, come with me. Let me go back, Let, let's go have something to eat. Let's go to a burger joint and eat something on my charge. Or somebody I call from Liberia is talking about, see, I need some money, man. Can you help me? No problem. If I have a 30, 40 euros, I send it to Liberia. It's not a, it's not a big deal for me. 
I just want to encourage you, brother. Share your money. Share your money and pray. Seek the Lord. Each and every day, seek the Lord. But this is this this world is coming to an end. This is our destiny. This is this is the hour is approaching soon. The hour is approaching soon. The hour is approaching soon. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching. I'm Zeke Alenka, and I'm glad that you you are watching this video. I hope you watch. You are still watching to the end. But I'm glad that you're watching this video. And uh, I can only encourage you to keep tuning in. Subscribe to my channel. Share the video. I like, press the like button. Whatever you want to do. No stress. Feel free. Thank God. Have a blessed day. Bye.